Hi, welcome to my channel and today I have another theatre vlog for you. So tonight we're actually heading to the Lowry to see 42 Balloons, which is a brand new musical. We're actually going to see it in its preview week because it was cheaper. We couldn't afford the tickets on the, uh, once it had opened because they were quite expensive. Um, so we managed to pay £20 each for our seat, which was really good. And we're really looking forward to it. Heard loads of good things about it. Obviously I went to the showcase for it and got to hear a couple of songs sung by the cast. So I've been really looking forward to it ever since then. So we're really excited. Can't wait to see it. Take you along with us. Don't know if there'll be any merch with it being a new show. We'll have to see when we get there, but I don't think they will have. Um, but yeah, it should be a really good night. So I'm going to take you along, show you around the theatre, and then obviously give you a little review, because it's in previews, so I'll give a proper full review, but I'll give you a little review of what we think of it when we got home. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this little vlog. So we've just arrived at Media City now. See, theatre's just behind us. And we're actually in this theatre today, the little theatre at the back, the Keys Theatre. That is where 40 Balloons is on. So we're gonna make our way over there, find our seats and stuff. So I don't think there's any merch, but I think there will be programmes, so find a programme and have a look around. So I'll get back to you once we're inside. Minutes of it going to take our seats. We're in the stalls, we're on row L. I can't remember what numbers. Okay, so we're in row L, seat one and two. This way. This is the view from our seats and um, we'll get back to it in the interval and tell you what we think. Okay. 
so it is now the intro. What do you think, Lauren? I really like it. It's really good. Really good. Really looking the staging. I'm interested. Yeah, that's very interesting to do the staging. Is but it I, I like it. Of blue? Basically, that's what it is. Yeah. Inside of them. Okay. And they have little steps, hill, the slants. Yeah. It's very good. Very really, really good. Really really it. It's good. Mm -hmm. uh, Choreography as well, with it. Yeah, the choreography is really good, and the story is really good. Really, really enjoyed it. Can't wait to see what the second half is like now. It's funny. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. So far, I'm doing all that. Find myself bopping on to it. So we. I know. I can tell. <laughs> He's like nodding his head along to it. Bessie's one or two songs that I've listened to. The frequently least that I've been think, quite enjoyed seeing yeah. it. On yeah, stage. So can't wait for the second half now, so obviously we'll talk more about it after the show, but yeah, really enjoying it so far at the interview. Brilliant. Finished. I really enjoyed that, didn't we? It's a top way show. I'll come back in a heartbeat easily. I'm yeah, watching. It was really, really good. So the show has just finished now. We really, really enjoyed that. What do you think? Do you really enjoy it? Yeah. Yes. Uh, the end, and I didn't know about. So that was. Yeah, he didn't know. It happened. I won't tell you. I won't spoil it. Yeah. Uh, in case you don't know the story. But yeah, we really, really enjoyed that. We'd love to see that again, but I don't think we can afford you to know, come back and see it. I'll happily but see that. Really, Two, three, four times. really, really enjoyed it. And also, we really loved the, oh, the tables the outside. They're all 42 balloon tables. But yeah, it was really good. It's on for, I think, till the end of May. Anyway, favourite musical so far I've seen this year, stuff. So. Yeah, I agree. It's the favourite one we've seen so far this year. Um, Anyway, we'll talk more about it when we get home, but yeah, we really, really enjoyed that. Hi! So, I am now back from seeing 42 Balloons, and I thought I'd tell you a little bit about the show. Now, I'm not going to give a full review in this video because it is still in previews. Tonight was only its second night of previews, so I don't want to give a review on it now. Um, I am hoping I can go back after previews is finished and then do a full review on it. Um, but I'm not sure yet if I'm able to go, so um, hopefully I will be able to go and then I will give you a full review. But today I'm just going to give you a little bit of information on the show and just tell you a little bit what it's like, but I'm not giving it a full review. However, I will say it is definitely the best show that we've seen this year, so that might give you a little insight of what, what my review would be like. Um, so we went to see the show on Friday the 19th of April, um, which was its second uh, preview. Its first preview was on the Thursday on the 18th, so we went to the second day. The show is on in the Keys Theatre at the Lowry, which is the Lowry's smaller theatre, and performances start at 8pm. 
we were sat in the stalls for this show we were sat on row l seats one and two and our view was absolutely excellent from there lots of leg room really comfortable seats uh i would definitely recommend those seats and what i would say is for this show you probably are better sitting a little further back rather than nearer the front in the stalls just because of the way it's staged i think you get a fuller picture of what's going on if you sit further back um because just the way the staging is i just think you get a better view sat a little bit further back so that's what i recommend if you go and see it maybe don't sit right near the front sit a little bit maybe towards the middle towards the back and i think you will get a better view um there was actually merch for the show i wasn't expecting there to be any merch with it being a new show but they had quite a bit of merch actually i think i did film it for you so they had i think there was two t-shirts um there was a hoodie i think it was a zip-up hoodie they had a water bottle they had a mug um they had an enamel pin pin badge they had a magnet a tote bag um and I think that was it and obviously a programme so I bought the programme which I believe was £6 and I also bought a magnet which I think was £6 um can't remember but I think I filmed the price list so hopefully you will have seen that so that's what I purchased I really wanted the hoodie because it's a nice zip up hoodie but it was £45 it was more than we spent on the ticket so no I couldn't get that one but I would really like the hoodie because I really enjoyed this show so I will tell you a tiny little bit about the story so the story is actually based on a real event which took place in 1982 a guy called Larry Walters made a homemade aerostat using a lawn chair and a 40 or 42 weather balloons and he ended up flying over LA um, in his lawn chair so it's based on this true story um, the songs in it are all original songs written by Jack Godfrey and they've all got like an 80s feel to it and the soundtrack for this show is absolutely amazing absolutely amazing I loved every single song in this show absolutely amazing songs really wish they had the full uh cast album out there's a few there's an ep with a few songs on but it's not enough i need all of them they were all so good um and definitely the best musical soundtrack that i've heard for a while absolutely amazing songs uh one thing about this musical is actually a sung through musical so there's no uh dialogue it's all sung through i mean there is dialogue but it's sort of sung dialogue but it's easy to follow you may have seen in some of the videos me saying that i hate sung through musicals but this one was really easy to follow the style of it is is really good so it didn't bother me that it was sung through and like i said it was really easy to follow staging wise the staging for this is so good really good i loved the staging i loved the way it was staged it's actually staged to look like you're inside of a weather balloon which i thought was really clever they also use a lot of projections as well which were really good and it was just fantastic really really enjoyed it i definitely recommend it if you can get to Lowry to go and see it do um, i'm not going to go through the program today like i said because this is previews if i do get to go and see it to review it then I'll do a proper full review and show you the programme then. But for now, that is all I'm going to say on the matter. Lawrence also absolutely loved it. He really wants to go back and see it again. So, yeah, that is what I'm going to say on 42 Balloons. I hope you enjoyed this little vlog, just to give you a little taste of what it is like. It's on at the Larry till the 19th of May, so there's plenty of time to go and get tickets and see it. And yeah, I think this is going to be the next big musical. I can definitely see this transfer into the West End. Um, it's fantastic. And I'm just really glad that it's in Manchester and we've got to go and see it. Because if it was in London, we probably wouldn't get a chance to see it. So really glad that it's been on at the Lowry. And yeah, like I said, I hope you've enjoyed this little vlog. If you do enjoy theatre vlogs like this, then do subscribe to the channel. I do loads of theatre vlogs on here and reviews. Um, I've got tickets for The Wizard of Oz coming up. 
um, Aladdin, lots of things. So if you'd be interested in seeing any of those, like I said, do subscribe, hit the notification bell, and be notified as soon as any of those goes up. So yeah, like I said, hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, do give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.